Hey, what's going on? Welcome to House of Amenike. I am the one, the only KW33 and Queen. Welcome to House of Amenike. And this is the Gemini Daily Spiritual Guides and Messages, where I will tap in and find out what messages your spiritual guides have for you for today. Okay, and that is for today, April the 26th. Okay, 2022 for Gemini. So let's get into it. Also, if you're new here, welcome. Um, I hope you like this channel. Here on this channel, we do all kinds of tarot readings, love, relationship, um, business, uh, tapping in with your spiritual guys like we're about to do today, all kinds. Okay, and um, give make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe, hit that notification bell, so that way you will always be notified when I post beautiful videos such as this one. Okay, and also if you would like a personal in-depth reading to get more in-depth into what it is that you need to know, what it is that you need to hear, um, or whatnot, you can definitely book a reading with me at House of Amenike at gmail.com. You will see it down below on the ticker. Um, also, yeah, let's get into it. <laughs> let's see what messages your spirit you guys got for you. Okay. All right. Thank you. So we have food, playful, plan, no, projecting and fuel. Okay. First one, food. What I eat fuels me. I eat the best foods accessible to me. I infuse my food with love and gratitude before eating, visualizing, and nutrients. I am consuming in the love that went into growing and preparing the food. Okay? So some of you is saying, uh, for I mean, so Spirit is saying for some of you is you need to fill yourself with some food. So some of you may have not been eating as much or you know, um, eating enough. <laughs> okay. So you need to, yeah, eat some food. Playful. You have, I go about life playfully and take things lightly. I can turn any hard day or heavy burden into a fun adventure. Why spend time upset when there is so much fun to be had? So yeah, Spirit is saying, have fun, enjoy life. You know, don't stress about the little things that's out of your control. You know, have fun. Projecting. Rather than reacting and projecting my emotions onto others, I remember no one is to blame. No one is responsible for the emotions that I feel. When someone says or does something that brings up strong emotions within me, I have the ch I have the change in how I respond. So yeah, spirit is saying, think before you react. You know what I'm saying? It's not their fault, you know. Because I'm one of those people, when I get upset, everybody can get it, okay? Like, don't bother me. Don't come. But don't mess with me when I'm upset. So, <laughs> I definitely feel. Excuse me. I had to wet my throat. Okay? So, yeah. Um, really think about what you're saying before you say it, okay? Before you start projecting, okay? Um, feel. I enjoy doing things that fuel me. It feels great to do things for myself just as much as I do for others. When I make sure I am taken care of, I can better show up for those in my life and for the work I do. Yeah, so um, do things that fuel you, that, you know, excites you. Okay, that's what Spirit is saying. Have fun with the playing card, okay, that came out as well. Okay, Gemini, let's see what other messages we have for Gemini today on April 26th. Let's, let's see what other messages we have for Gemini. What other messages do we, okay, thank you. So we have peace and indecision that flipped over. Okay, so with the peace card, I am, be, I am a being of love. And release all negative energy. So your spiritual guys are saying, be peaceful at this time. You know what I'm saying? Be a being of love. Be a being of peace. You know, don't, let that let that shit go. Release all negative energy. Anything that doesn't serve you. Okay. Indecision. I use my intuition 
in all in all aspects of life. Okay, so some of you you can be indecisive about something. You know what I'm saying? And your spirit your spiritual team is saying use your intuition on this, okay? You know the answer. Okay? You know the answer. Okay? You have acceptance. I am learning to accept the things I cannot change. Yes. You know, it be some it, it may be something that you want to change, but at this moment is out of your hands, so you just got to accept it. Okay? So spirit is saying accept it, okay? Accept what you can't change. Okay? Let's see. Let's get one more message. Spirit, can we get one more? Thank you. That's two. Okay, so we got surrender and honesty that popped up. I can release my need to control. So for some of you, you may be want to be in control of a situation right now. And your spiritual team is saying, no, surrender. Release that control. No, you don't need to be in control this time. You don't need to be in control all the time. Okay, so surrender. Okay, and let things play out the way how they're supposed to play out. Okay, honesty. I can't always expect the truth from others, but I can expect it from myself. Okay, so for some of you, um, <clears throat> what I'm getting with this indecision card that had came out to, you know what I'm saying? Um, about using your intuition, intuition. Somebody might be lying to you or something, and you gotta realize that you, you know, sometimes us as individuals, we be looking for ourselves and other people, and you have to come in, come to realization that everybody's not you. Everybody's not gonna handle the situation that you handle it as. Everybody's not gonna be honest or blunt as you are. You know, you're gonna have motherfuckers to lie. You're gonna have motherfuckers to sneak. You're gonna have motherfuckers to cheat, steal, whatever the fuck. You know what I'm saying? saying so we got to learn to stop trying to make everybody out to be like us because they're not you're not always going to find yourself in people and we got to be cool with that okay all right so let's go to the next one next message is okay we're going to see what your moon message is gemini okay what messages do you have for gemini what messages do you have for Gemini today on April 26, 2022? What messages do you have for Gemini? Thank you, Spirit. So you got two cards. You got look at the bigger picture. Okay? So for some of you, you may need to look at the bigger picture when it comes to a situation. I'm not sure if you can see that. Okay? And also you got the energy is gaining momentum. So, you know, shit is gaining gaining some shit, you know, gaining some, some some momentum on it, whatever it is. Okay. So you got your commitment is being tested. Okay. So some of you, okay, nothing yet is set in stone. Okay. And you got, you're very close to achieving your goal. Okay. So your spiritual guys is saying, you know, look at the bigger picture. You know what I'm saying? And you're being tested right now. Okay, you're being tested right now. So whatever it is that you're aiming for, whatever it is that you're wanting to know, whatever it is that's going on around you, it's not yet set in stone, whatever that is for you. Okay, and whatever it is that you're working close towards, you're getting closer to your goals. Okay, so I'm definitely seeing that you're you're closer than you think. Okay, let's see what your ancestors have to say to you right now, Gemini. Okay. Gemini, what do your ancestors need to say to you? What messages do your ancestors need you to hear today? Ancestors, what do Gemini need to hear? What do ancestors, what do Gemini need to hear? Give me a message. Thank you. Okay. You have taking care of yourself is an essential is an is essential right now. Make the time yourself. Let me read that over because I sound slow as shit. Okay. Taking care of yourself is, is, I don't know why I want to say is the, okay. Taking care of yourself is essential right now. Make the time for yourself. So spirit is saying, make time for yourself right now. Okay. It's, it's needed. 
And whatever question that you've been um, asking your spiritual guides about or whatever it is that you've been praying about or whatever you've been manifesting or whatever you want to know if it's coming or you want to know if it's going to be set in stone or whatever the case is, your spiritual guide said yes, yes, yes. Okay, so the answer is yes, three times. And remember, good things come in what? Three. Okay, what else, ancestors, do you want them to know? Do you want Gemini to know? Thank you. Okay, your ancestors said no, it just wasn't for you. What is yours will always be yours. Okay, okay, so. Something right now that you probably thought it was all for you or it was supposed to have been all your spirit is saying, no, it just wasn't for you. Okay. But what is coming, it's going to be yours and it's always going to be yours. Okay. So yeah. So what is coming, it's going to be yours for the keeping, not for the sharing, not for the, the debate. <laughs> okay. You're not going to have to fight for it. You're not going to have to fight over it because it's yours. Okay, that's what Spirit is saying. So what will be will always be yours. Okay, so whatever it is that you had to let go or whatever the case, it wasn't just yours, but what's coming is going to be yours. Okay, also you got, it, it's time to forgive. Forgiveness can help you heal. So for some of you, your, your ancestors are saying, forgive a situation so that way you can heal from it. Okay. And also, kings and queens are not bothered by the pages of courts. Okay? So, honey, whoever this message is for, you are a king. You are a queen. And guess what? Whatever the problem or the situation is or whoever it is, they are a, uh, a um, shit. I just had it. <laughs> they are a... a um, shit. What the fuck? I hate that shit. Because I'm a mommy going a million miles. They are a peasant. There we go. You are a king or a queen. The king or the and the queen, they are not uh, concerned with the peasant, okay? The peasant doesn't make nothing over here with the queen feel no, no kind of way, okay? So that's the peasant. That's trying to get your attention or that's trying to make you feel some type of way. And kings and queens, we don't entertain the bullshit. Okay? That's what your spiritual guys are saying. All right? And we're going to get one more message from your ancestors. What's the last and final message for Gemini ancestors? Okay? We have, you are so much closer than you think. Keep going. Wow. So you got that two times. So you're getting closer. Whatever it is that you've been manifesting, whatever it is that you've been aiming for or working towards, Gemini, it is coming. You are closer than you think. So keep it up, okay? Keep manifesting. Keep going after your goals, your dreams, whatever the case is, whatever it is that you're doing, okay? And that is it. And that is all for you, Gemini, Gemini, Gemini. Okay, thank you so much for watching House of Amenike. I am the one, the only KW33 and Queen. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. I hope this resonated with you all. And if so, please let me know down in the comments. Also, make sure you hit that notification bell so that way you will always be notified when I post beautiful videos such as this one. Okay, and until next time, I hope you all have a beautiful rest of your day, a beautiful rest of your week. Stay blessed, stay fresh, and be beautiful, baby, and let the rest go. Love y'all.